Hi everyone, this is Scalo and Mia. Welcome to this video. I'm here with Acer. And Acer is a little character from Cars 2. He is a AMC Pacer car. Um, I think those cars were produced by AMC. I think that stands for American Motors Company. And they were available in the 70s. Uh, I think they were nice cars, but they had a very broad hood. And they were kind of heavy because of lots of uh, glass parts on them. So they consumed quite a lot. But still, I think those cars are really cute. And that's why I got Acer. He's a little Disney store design. And he is actually one of the bad guys in Cars 2. So that's about Acer. He's actually really cute, you know. But it's just that, yeah, he doesn't seem to be really understood, actually, in his uh, way of being himself. Um, anyway... I'm here with a little haul because, well, hauls are kind of rare these days because I rarely go into shops. Um, as I'm looking for a lot of Sonic stuff, I get stuff online and, well, because I can't find anything in shops, I prefer to uh, to keep some money for um, when I have to look one up online or getting get something online. So that's why. Um, even though Comic-Con is coming up, so I'll make sure to make some nice videos there too and hopefully I'll find some Sonic stuff there I, so, I certainly hope so but I'm afraid here just Super Mario is much more popular and I didn't see any Sonic stuff in the by previous occasion at Comic Con so I, I really hope to find something this year uh, but I got something else I got Big Yoda over there he's just awesome anyway uh, that will be for next week so I hope you will enjoy these videos as well um, now to start as well, I would like to show you some adorable little plush. You might remember, um, all those little fruity plush, I don't mind the hedgehogs. Um, that my grocery has been, yeah, uh, having in summer with a special offer. You could actually collect all the different plush they were. And apparently those guys are back now with some new fruities. I was kind of, well, um, surprised. To see that but I started collecting right away and um, I have been collecting well now they have the pair up there but I had that one already because of a little order mistake and there we have the little uh, garlic who is really sweet and also available now but they also have a few others first of all I got the celery and he's really funny actually it doesn't actually look so much like a celery to me. I think the leaves on top might have been a bit more spectacular or a bit more um, overgrowing, but yeah, he has like little branches here and he's just really sweet. Actually, I, I don't really have a name for him. Uh, I think his name is Celeste. They have such stupid names, you have no idea. And he is a celery. And they are plushies from the Goodness Gang. Really adorable plush. Uh, actually, you can compare them with Webkins. They feel like the same. They are stuffed like the same. Their size is a bit larger. But they have beans in them. And Celery has like... Little dark feet. So that's the first one. And this is the yellow pepper that I've been collecting. But I had him off eBay. Um, and then... Another cute one is the pineapple. I took a nice stuffed one um, and I just love his little haircut here. <laughs> so it's really cute and it's all fleecy. It's not like the felt material of the celery here uh, which is a bit more rough. But here it's really fleecy. It's so adorable. I got that one for my Spongebob's. <laughs> um, really cute. I saw this one on eBay for about 72 euros. So crazy how, uh, how crazy people can be. But yeah, you can just get this one for the full price, $12.99, or just collect and have him for $4.99, or $3.99, I believe. This is him. He's a pineapple. And they both have similar tags. And the last one that I have been collecting for now was this aubergine. And I like actually the the little leaves here and this part it's really cute so 
that is really typical and really soft. What I don't like about the aubergine is that she looks like a purple pear. So, uh, in fact, there's like no difference compared with the pear. The pear has a leaf on top. Um, but they look quite the same when it comes on shape. Um, she has a nice color here. Here's another tag. And I still have to collect another one, which will be a blueberry. But I'm actually um, collecting little uh, coins for it. So, and once I have the coins, I can go for it and buy it for a really tiny price. So, there you go. These are my little fruities. And then, um, actually, during a little trip in the city, yeah, well, I wasn't actually looking for quite much. I didn't know what I, what I would actually come across. But the sad thing these days is what I'm actually looking for is just mostly unavailable anywhere. So actually I was just looking for nice BFFs, um, nice BFF um, bracelets or little uh, necklaces for my plush. Um, actually I have been having this one here. Mm, where is it? Oh, here it is. So I've been using these guys, uh, these guys, yeah, those little bracelets with letters. But unfortunately, I bought all the ones that I uh, that were with an S. So now I have to look for something else. And I went to Claire's, and there they had these uh, little BFF bracelets. They were kind of cheap. You had like five in one packaging, and I've been dividing had them over a few of my plush silvers, wearing uh, one. Um, I think I have shadow here. Can can show you how it works. So he has I did I used the white one for him. It fits him the best. And it says BFF and just a little bracelet around his neck. So yeah. Actually I removed his little pink S because it was kinda <laughs> funny on him. Um But I've been trying on several little bracelets and several plush and I came to the conclusion that I could actually use some more um, I'm still not really completely out of it, because I still have to divide some. But these were a good buy, and this was actually, like, all I found. Or, or all I was interested in. I found nice Charizard, Tommy Charizard and Blastoise. But I didn't get these guys because I was actually saving for uh, online shopping, so... That's why there are so much package videos these days. Um, and then I would like to, oh, hold on a second, this is funny. Yeah, I couldn't help it, I got one of, another one of these uh, adorable hedgehogs. <laughs> it was on the market, um, so this is actually how they come in their box. And they're like nine, the large ones are like nine and ninety-five. Um, which is a really good price actually for such nice finished dog toys. And also for such a pretty box, um, dog toys can be so expensive. And these cars are quite honest when it comes on the price. And actually I took it out. And again, it's, it's like a hedgehog with a gigantic quill section here. A really ballish back. Uh, but still, I just love it. I wanted to pick the last one they had. But apparently they have been restocking and they had a larger one in stock. So I took the large one, of course. So that's gonna be for my, for my hedgehog, another one of those. And now I have like three larger ones. And three smaller ones. I have three small ones, uh, two small ones here. And uh, there we have Twinkie. Can't find the other. Here's another large one. Yeah, I have been collecting plenty. I'm in love with those. And I'm definitely sure that if I see another one by a random occasion, I'll just get it once again. I really gotta stop with that, but <laughs> I just can't help it. Um, and then I, um, well, I had a little go in the thrift shop yesterday. And it was kind of disappointing. We're like no plush at all. So it was like nothing, really nothing. Also because Facebook Marketplace is gaining success and now... There's a problem that every, everybody puts their stuff on Facebook for sale and that might have a certain influence on um, thrift, thrift shops. Anyway, 
I uh, came across two adorable DVDs. I got uh, What's Eating Gilbert Grape for my parents, and it's really such a pretty movie. Um, but I got this one for myself here, Snow Dogs, and I've been really enjoying this movie. It was awesome. It's a good movie, I think. Um, and I have been seeing it when I was... I saw it when I was, like, nine years old, I think. It's quite long ago. I'm actually happy I saw it again. So, yeah, that's my DVD. Also, I came across this adorable little plastic dog. I believe it's a Shetland sheep dog. Um, he has, like, a hairy tail. They were like a lot of lots of figurines. And I have been looking through them. See if there was something special. And um well this was actually the ones the one that fits my collections the most. So I just took it. There was this was actually my very first find. Well, I wasn't actually sure I would actually take it with me, but only if I would if I would find some more stuff. And um Oh yeah, one more th one more thing that I have to show you afterwards. Now, after uh, having a look, I found something really amazing. I did not expect something kind of rare. And after all, it was a good idea to come to the thrift shop just for this. I came across. I'm, I'm, I gotta get up for this. I won't pick it off the wall. I got this adorable little uh, Sonic um, ornament there. So it's a little picture of um, all the characters from Sonic X. I've been enjoying that series so much. And uh, I was so amazed that was there, like really by coincidence. And there I was, completely by coincidence. So I, I just took it with me right away. It was even a bit broken on top, but the cashier has been making it for me. And now it's just awesome. It has like, Vector, SPO, Charmy, Amy, Cream and Cheese, Rouge. I think that's Gamma there, and there's Shadow as well, and Sonic, Tails and Knuckles. Really pretty. And it just fits the wall perfectly, so yeah. It has the right dimensions to go there. So I was like really pleased anyway of my visit. <laughs> Uh, and one last adorable thing that I would like to show you is something my neighbor made for me. Um, he made me this adorable Kylie shirt. Um, so cute. I had one like this, but we have been washing it because my mom wanted me to wear it. And it was completely broken afterwards, so... I'm definitely going to keep this one. And... Uh, it's just amazing. So this is just a random picture from on my phone. I photographed her when she was just standing on the trampoline. And um, look at her. She's such a pretty dog. And her black leg. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna keep this one forever, I think. Um, don't feel like wearing it, actually. It doesn't really fit me and the, the drawing is not really in the right place. So maybe I can just, yeah care for it this way and make sure it doesn't get damaged because I don't know I don't know much people who can actually make this and someone making this for you is kind of special so I just don't want to ruin it again now I guess this is gonna be it for my little haul I really hope you enjoyed the video guys and I'll see you later thanks for watching bye